Today, I want to talk to you about God's comfort. You know, when we lose a dear one, it can take a piece of ourselves. We wonder how life will be without this person. It says in John 14, verses 1 and 2, Let not your hearts be troubled. In my Father's house are many rooms. It is a great comfort to know that your loved one, that you miss so dearly, is still alive. Matter of fact, I believe more alive and and happy. And if we know that they're happy and alive, then that takes the greatest grief away from us. We realize that Our grief is for ourselves because we will miss them. We know that no life is ever wasted. No love ever fails. No prayer is in vain. God's life is forever. God's love is forever. And truth in God, it endures. Any sense of loss is alleviated, any feeling of grief is taken away as we lean on God's love. Deep comfort of the soul that only God's presence and power can give becomes ours. Deep peace of mind that only God's light can bring is ours. Deep knowing that all things have meaning and purpose is ours as we lean on God's love. And as we lean on God's love, we're filled with an overwhelming energy and power and comfort. We see the eternal, the overall plan of good. And we see that all life's experiences are important to the whole. And we see that our lives and the lives of our dear ones are flowing in the direction of God's good. We see ourselves and our dear ones as travelers on a continuing path of life. And we see that those who seem to pass from life really pass into life, into life, into another room in our Father's house of unending rooms, unending eternal life. Dear God, we thank you for the love that sustains and comforts us in our time of need. We thank you for the profound comfort beyond even our human understanding that you give. In Jesus Christ's name, amen.